So this is a, another Nintendo DS Lite. So when I showed the other day in one of my other videos how it's got bottom screen flashing won't won't turn on. So top screen's the issue. I wasn't going to worry about videoing it because I've already covered that a few times. When I took its clear casing off though, saw this rusted out screw so I thought maybe there's something else going on in here. I'll capture it and see if there is anything because I'm not even sure. That's pretty rusted over. Uh, okay. Yeah, we got some liquid damage. All that. Right out. All this changes things a bit. Where did that come from? Um, so better get this board the whole way out and see the extent of the damage. Looks like another aftermarket one. The screws look different. I guess the other thing we can do is use one of our test screens to see. So if it doesn't power up off the test screen as well, then we definitely know that this board is causing us some dramas as well. Oh man. Ooh. That connector's different. That connector's very different. Stick in there. Get a close look. Moist. Look at all that. That headphone connector looks like someone's done something funky down there or something. Alright. Bit of corrosion on the ribbon cable there. Alright, first things first. Test screen. Got one of the test screens to try and power it off that. I don't think the screen's the entire thing to blame here. I 
Let's see what happens. I didn't put the Wi Fi board on. Gets me every time. Start the cleaning. Maybe we'll even go into the microscope. Get a better look. Let's do that, shall we? So just take the front screen off as well now.
Well, after all, all those wires that have been run, see that long one there, a heap of little ones there, a heap of little ones there, there's just too many corroded wires. It probably didn't help that I drilled them out so much, but it didn't work anyway. And it still doesn't. It got closer. I mean, if I kept at it, did every single one, maybe, but the amount of time and effort put into it isn't really worth it. At least turns on now. So I was getting there. But it was a fun little experiment to use the grinding pen and run so many little wires. I've not really done that before, so unsuccessful on that one today, but I'll keep trying in the next one.